the cabinet minister for energy and mineral development Dr. Ruth Nankabirwan Setamo has today afternoon launched an electricity access scale-up project for the West Nile region where electricity consumers will be connected to the national grid. During the launch of this project at Nebi Town Secondary School playground on Friday 2nd August 2024, Honorable Minister Ruth Nankabirwan said this project will benefit local people who are 90 meters away from the electricity poles. I am revenging because you put us on fire the day we stepped in Arua with the members of parliament. You put us on fire. Good fire. I am now firing back with the result. Thank me to God. Today we are here on the electric sector scale up project which my permanent secretary has expounded on greatly. She added that the connection to the national grid will boost business within the West Nile region. Affordable loan. So it is a project that we are implementing to assist people on the shared prosperity and we appreciate and we will not let you down. We'll come for more. Because we have so many communities. Honorable Hashim Suleiman, Member of Parliament the Municipality, used the same event to thank the Energy Ministry for launching the project. Has this has been the biggest challenge for the people of West Nile region. According to Honorable Hashim, the free connection will enable other government institutions like schools, health centers to have power. Agenda very seriously. When I joined them, and Honorable Minister, you remember by that time you were the government chief whip in our parliament, and we really disturbed you about power connection here. We could always, as a caucus, go to you to organize meetings for us with the Minister of Energy and Mineral Development to really push for grid connection here, the national grid. Meanwhile, Fred Mungachel, one of the beneficiaries who have been connected to the project, lauded the government for this milestone since there has been public outcry for connecting them to the national grid. It does take me long. In the space of like uh, three weeks, I was connected to power. I'm really very happy for that. And more so, uh, the team from from the mills, I guess so, because they have all along been driving here. They were always here checking on me every time. And uh, yeah, it's all that you people from us there, you are committed to serving us here. However, Robert Abak, Aradis Nebi district, revealed that ever since Nebi became a district, power challenge has been the order of the day, as many leaders were blaming the NRM government for abandoning them through national grid power connection. Since the creation of this app, this is the first time that Navy District and West Nile is getting connected to high voltage grid. As we give glory to God, we should not forget also thanking NRM government and the wise leadership of His Excellency the President for at least making us achieve this goal. We must thank you on his behalf and thank you for being focused really for considering West Nile. This shows a spark of progress, a beacon of hope has the West Nile region finally connected to the national grid. Alfred Jawok, West Nile TV, Nile cast. <laughs> Yeah. yeah.